G'day everyone, it's Rigsy here. I just sort of give you a quick update on how we're doing. Uh, we've been in Canada now for a week. So we departed Sydney last Wednesday and we arrived on the same day in Vancouver because of the 17-hour uh, difference that Canada's behind us. Uh, got into Vancouver, we were met by uh, the BC Forestry Service people. We were then bussed out to a place about an hour and a half east of Vancouver called Chilliwack where we uh, stayed for a few days at the Royal Canadian Mounted Police Training Facility. And... Uh, there we got our in-country induction and briefing uh, about fuel types and our roles and fire behaviour and um, just fill in the gaps of the differences between, I guess, Australia and Canada and some of the terminology. It also included um, some fun stuff, things on bears and what, what to do with a black bear and a grizzly bear and, um, you know, moose and all these sorts of things. And then also we had a uh, RCMP uh, police officer from the driving instruction branch come and talk to us and uh, talk to us about driving because of course they drive on the wrong side of the road over here and I must admit I've jumped in the car on the wrong side three times already to find no steering wheel. So uh, once we finished those inductions there and um, most people were then given all their gear, in fact everyone was given their gear, helmets, sleeping bags, uh, first aid kits, a whole range of things that you needed to go out into the fire camps and from there on Saturday and Sunday people were then deployed out uh, either as individual resources or as the incident management teams to various fires uh, right across the province. So, um, you know, the people are already out there. They've hit the ground running. They've done their changeovers. I know the, the Australian IMTs have uh, taken command of the fires that they're on and all the individual resources are out doing various jobs from, in my case, uh, air operations. There's logistics people embedded at Cam Loops, which is where the provincial... Uh, wildfire centre is, uh, there's people doing zone jobs and of course there's people working on fires as well um, such as um, doing HELCO which is the equivalent of an air attack supervisor, air branch director which is air ops manager uh, and then you've got finance chiefs, logistics plans, a whole range of things so all, uh, all feedback so far is that the Aussies are doing really well, uh, everyone's safe, everyone's well, there's a lot going on over here and uh, I look forward to giving you an update again about what's going on. Uh, maybe in the next week.